Good evening, Rugby League. First, Wallaroo skipper Todd Campbell has recovered from the virus that saw him hospitalised before Sunday's loss to Easts. The Wallaroos finished within eight points of toppling an undermanned Magpie side in a high-scoring contest at Salter Oval. Easts and the Wallaroos appeared to have abandoned their defensive game plans as players from both sides managed to find the line with ease. The Wallaroos took a four-point lead to the break but failed to capitalise when the Magpies were reduced to 12 men after forward Tyson Knight was sent off. Fifteen tries were scored in the contest. East players Kyle Laybutt and Willie Nagus were the standouts with the Magpies winning 42-34. to We had about um, eight players out, even our main captain, Matty Tanner, so well, it, was, it was a good win in the end. We came back but still had a couple of tries in. We should have kept them out. But, oh well, they played well. The Wallaroos were also hindered by the absence of some of their best. Had no size on the bench, you know, it's, it's always hard to um, play a game like that. Yeah. We're missing one of our most important players and our captain, Todd Campbell. In Sunday's main game, brothers flexed their muscle to show why they're top of the ladder with a dominant 18-point win over Isis. The brethren still impressive despite missing some of their stars to Central United selection. The Central District's representative side finished third at the two-day carnival on the Sunshine Coast. Brothers star Matt Templeman was one of the standouts, his performance enough to earn Queensland Rangers selection. The Rangers will meet a New South Wales rep side in Lismore next month. Ryan Hiscox, Win News.